this video is sponsored by Fanatic.dk. What is going on guys? Dr. Joe here back again with our Theros booster box opening. This box has been pretty good to us so far. I'd say it's better than I hoped and you know it's kind of the gamble with these old sets. You either get pretty lucky or you don't. But mostly I'm pretty lucky so let's dive into the rest of the packs here and before I start the video don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more magic videos. you guys so split these packs up right here we have four five and six yep that is correct dr. math I am however not a math genius at all but you know the simplicity of adding and subtracting numbers I think is pretty straightforward so it shouldn't be much of a problem another Carl or charlatan as he is called but we can start calling him Carl uh, I mean I don't think he would mind that it's not good to be a charlatan oh needs to go there there we go a land and we have a foil horizon Chimera. Yeah, again, the foiling is just too damn beautiful. Fleece Mane Lion, that was one of the good rares. Definitely nice. But as I just said, you know, the foiling on these kind of cards, it's just, it's so good. It just makes the art pop more. And, well, you pretty much can't ask for more than that. <clears throat> it's just crazy, you know? And that's why I much fell in love with magic at first another dual land temple of triumph very nice rare uh, we can just put it on fleece main right there yep can't complain about that and two actually pretty good uncommons i should say back in the day dissolve was fairly uh played a lot since you know it was good in blue and uh Scrying is always good. Another Night Howler. We got that in the first part, I think. And some uncommons. You know, a lot of uh, the cards in this set was actually pretty good for limited. Standard, however, there weren't that many cards that were worth playing. Sylvian carried it. That's one of the good rares. It has Defender, it has Hexproof, and it taps for any color of mana that you want. So it's, yeah, it's a pretty good card. Just have to get it out here. There we go. Oh, just thought it was a foil. There's our foil, Voyage End. It's however a common, so it's not that special. Another mythic, you guys, it's Perforos, God of the Forge. One of the good gods to pull in this set, so very nice. This second part of the box opening is definitely shaping up to be very good. I want to see... Oh, another dual land, Temple of Silence. I believe that is still played in uh, modern, so... That is pretty good. Just love that there's so much, you know, kind of value in this set. We are putting a lot of rares down here. We have an, a Crowen horse, so that's not one of the good rares that you want to see in the set, but we have been pretty lucky with this pack opening, so it's expected to go a bit downhill from now on. Another god, are you kidding me? And it's actually Heliod, god of the sun. Another good pull. How many gods did we get? Oh, we can check that out in the recap. I think we're at three now. I don't know how many mythics we pulled. I think we pulled five up to till this point. So it's an above average box. Another foil, but it is an uncommon. So and a hammer of perforos to go with our perforos god of the forge. Yeah, very nice. Let's see here. 
what we have. Colossus of Arcaros. Yeah, nothing too crazy. So, hopefully, we can pull Elspeth. Spear of Eliot. Are you kidding me? We're actually getting the weapons that go for uh, well with our gods? That's pretty nice. Imagine opening this box in a draft and then getting those pulls in your packs. That's the dream scenario right there. We have a gift of immortality. Don't remember if that card was good back in the day. I mean, all of these cards or a lot of the cards have potential to be good, but it's like, it depends on what format you play them in. Swamp, and we have Prophet of Prufix, one of the good rares. Definitely very nice. Just, uh, it can help you uh, draw endlessly because uh, it, it, it lets you untap all your creatures and lands during your opponent's turn. So that's pretty great. Another temple, uh, and it is of Abandon, uh, the red and green one. Very nice. Another Dissolve. So we have three more packs left here, you guys. Hopefully Elspeth is hiding in one of these packs and we will be able to pull her. A Foil Mountain, very nice. We have Bow of Nylea. It's a pretty good rare. Uh, so it deserves to go down here, of course, since you know that's where we put our good rares. Just bear with me while I do this, you guys. I know it takes a little while. Maybe I should just have done it with two hands. Yeah. But there you go. So this box has definitely been pretty good, I must say. Very nice opening. Dream opening, actually. Uh, couldn't ask for more. Soldier of the Pantheon. It's actually not true. I could actually ask for more. I could ask for an Elspeth. And hopefully, this is the pack. Let's see if she's hiding right here. Hopefully she is. And we have another, another Artisan of Forms. Yeah, so not the, the ending that I was hoping for, but hey, what are you gonna do? So let's just do a quick recap here, you guys, to see what we pulled. Uh, I'm just gonna go through the mythics since we pulled so many good rare cards. It's insane, actually. Uh, so let's just go through the, let's just go through the mythics and then the good rares. So we have Erebos, God of the Dead. We have Hero's Downfall, Temple of Deceit Foil. We have Thoughtseize. We have Ashen Raider. We have Medomai, yeah, Medomai, the Ageless Mythic. And we have Perforos, God of the Forge Mythic. And we have Heliod, God of the Sun. So you can't complain about a box like this, even though we pulled some, some crap mythics. There were definitely value in this one. Gotta say, very nice. And the thought sees is just freaking amazing. It's it's just, you know, really awesome when you pull cards that you want. And thought sees is definitely one of the cards that you want to pull in this set. So that's it for this part of the video, guys. Please remember to thumbs up, comment, share, all that good stuff. You know the drill. It helps other people find in my channel, and it makes it possible for me to do more videos for you guys. So again, thank you so much for watching this video. And don't forget to subscribe.